Hi everyone, this is Fleming Yakuma with another amazing new mod representing Sri Lanka. Uh, this is the Unimog for uh, SnowRunner. Uh, first of all, I hope everyone's doing safe out there and a huge welcome to my channel. Uh, remember to subscribe to my channel and show your support. It's what drives me to create uh, these kind of content uh, for you. So uh, let us get right into the mod. So soon as you start the game, uh, you can head right into the store and purchase the Uni Amor from uh, the truck store and you can use it as it is. So uh, this truck is not overpowered, uh, it uh, definitely can do your usual scouting and uh, traversing the wilderness. Uh, when I say it's not overpowered, like it actually does stop uh, when you're climbing mountains if you use it as it is. Uh, the engine is something, uh, it's taken out of uh, what you call the templates, the mod templates provided by Sabre Interactive. Uh, so I think it was a TUZ uh, scout, so not powerful at all. Uh, you can, and this is actually how the UDM uh, looks like. So uh, the only difference here is that I haven't included the uh, running board uh, at the back of the truck which enables uh, basically law enforcement officers to hang in from the sides of the vehicle uh, but that add-on is actually available in the store so you can install it so let's actually talk about the uni amov itself uh, a brief introduction into uni amov i'm not going to go into much of the details because it's not actually relevant for snowrunner uh, so uh, the Uni AMOV is actually a superb 4x4 developed by uh, once again by the Sri Lankan electrical and mechanical engineers of the Sri Lankan army. So uh, for the burning question, what does Uni AMOV actually mean? Uh, Uni is actually something that the Sri Lankan uh, army actually uses uh, for uh, all their vehicles which they develop and AMOV is actually arti an artificial intelligence military operational vehicle. Uh, in real life, this vehicle has multiple cameras, it's uh, armored, uh, it stops bullets, it stops grenades, it stops mines uh, and its main purpose is to uh, be uh, transporting its passengers uh, safely and uh, n for nothing to happen to them. Uh, it's a pretty high-tech uh, piece of equipment for Sri Lanka and uh, it's uh, pretty cool so that's why I drew inspiration from that and uh, decided that you should definitely try it out in snow runner uh, the uni amov is actually designed for city uh, operations it's not for uh, I don't I I'm not sure but like it might not actually be for off-road uh, in the wilderness and all that but like why not it's snow runner so everyone can uh, play around with it so let's get down to the nitty gritties of uh, how I made this. Uh, while there was no blueprint whatsoever online to create this 3D model, I had used multiple videos, angles and all that and create uh, the 3D model. The dashboard itself is not the actual uni -Amo, but it does uh, look like it. Uh, the actual one I haven't uh, been able to get any blue uh, like uh, not blueprints uh, I haven't been able to get like a good uh, view for that so uh, it was a pretty difficult task and it's uh, not easy at all but like uh, it was a totally fun project this was one of the most interesting projects that I worked on and uh, compared to the previous model that I made uh, of the Unicolt uh, also developed by this let me uh, it this I had more knowledge and I think this is much better than the previous mod that I made so uh, I'm testing out the how uh, climb of the truck and as you can see the stock uh, uni aim of is not powerful it uh, gets stuck on the climbs uh, and definitely you have to upgrade uh, the vehicle to sort this out um, again I feel uh, I could have made it a bit uh, less uh, powerful also uh, but then it would be less fun uh, for some of the players too so back at the store when you're customizing the uni of there's multiple engines that you can uh, select and uh, I'm gonna go with the most powerful one at the moment uh, you have your standard gearboxes which you can select and you can raise the truck uh, slightly so 
you have your standard tires uh, uh, vanilla game tires and also custom tires i had developed for the uni aim of and these actually uh, studded snow tires which is good for mud and uh, uh, other kinds of uh, surfaces like snow uh, you got the standard spare wheel which you can remove if you uh, like but i recommend that you keep the uni aim of spare wheel uh, you can go in deep waters by using the snorkel and also you have different kinds of frame add-ons such as roof racks and uh, light bar uh, so the light bar is actually super cool as well <laughs> so i'll show it uh, case to you uh, the light bar in a minute this is the running board uh, which comes out with the original uh, uni aim of uh, for the law enforcement officers and you have even your stock uh, front bumpers and rims and i hope to increase this in the future date uh, i have different kinds of special skins which i can use and i'm going to select uh, this which is the military camo so uh, this is the military uni amo and uh, this is not actually how the real life uni amo looks like but just to add some fun to uh, snow run i decided to include this and uh, guess what i actually developed a roof mounted gun uh, i know i haven't i actually haven't seen any weapons on snow runner but that may be just me but and i thought it might be pretty cool if i included a <laughs> mountain gun on uh, top of the roof so uh, let's see in the future maybe i'll uh, try to upgrade it a bit more and uh, let's see how it comes out uh, also the uni of uh, performs really well on slopes and you can uh, get that like a real off-road experience that's what i really love about snow run it's uh, you actually feel free and it's like a place to get away from this whole uh, busy world while not actually going out so which is bad but like uh, i uh, <laughs> kind of love the game you got rocks you got water and uh, you got a snorkel so yeah the snorkel is a definite must on the uni aim of because uh, the standard uh, grill as soon as it gets covered uh, you're basically going to mess up your engine and it performs really well on rocks as you can see it bounces off <laughs> like a little rabbit so it's a fun mod to drive and i i'm like kind of really proud of my creation so you guys better like it <laughs> and uh, on mud i would say uh, it does uh, like it does get stuck uh, not most of the time but uh, it does get stuck so uh, as you can see I'm just trying my best to move through this uh, muddy area which is uh, a bit difficult for the uni aim of and um, I end up uh, winching myself uh, out of the mud so like I've seen so many comments of people saying it's uh, not uh like most of the mods are overpowered so if it is overpowered let me know i'll try my best to make it less overpowered uh while giving you an overpowered option too so let's see so i actually grabbed a little bit of inspiration you can say uh, from gta uh i really love the gta concept of park rangers so i actually thought about hey snow run is like all about exploring the wilderness so why not actually bring in a park ranger so it, it's like uh uh, it gives you that whole GT experience of <laughs> living the life of a park ranger and uh, all that so right here I'm uh, actually going to showcase you the internal dashboard how it looks like so it lights up in the night uh, I have put little details to the buttons and all that and also I have a reverse uh, camera as you can see in the bottom uh, of the uh, dashboard the uni of is like it is fun to drive and uh, it does have roof mounted uh, lights uh, in case which is required so i'm just switching right to night time just to showcase the night lights on the rooftop so it's really bright <laughs> So I'm um, uh, not going to showcase everything that I have done, I'm uh, just going to keep some room for you to explore yourselves too and uh, this is actually how uh, the night light, uh, the light bar actually works. So there's actually a police vehicle in there so you can see like that, it's like a snow runner, uh, kind of snow runner city police vehicle, I have just imagined it and uh, created it and uh, for the uni mob you can actually even uh, carry a trailer behind the uh, 
uh, truck too. So I'm actually gonna keep this episode really small, um, like playing around with YouTube. My channel is new, and uh, I would like to keep my uh, videos uh, pretty short and uh, like just different from uh, the standard videos. Uh, so do subscribe. Uh, like it, I get so excited when I see uh, the subscriptions, and I like want to create more and more of this uh, vehicle. So. Uh, I'm not only going to concentrate on SnowRunner in the upcoming months, I have so many different plans so uh, do stay in tuned, uh, I'm looking at other games to uh, create uh, Sri Lankan based mods so uh, I hope you all enjoyed my mod, uh, like uh, do drop your comments what you would like to see, uh, I will at some point do uh, try to teach you all uh, how to make these mods using Blender for uh, snow runner but um, that's again uh, it will take some time because it that's a huge amount of things that uh, you have to uh, process uh, to get it sorted uh, so uh, until next time I hope you all stay safe uh, have fun and uh, see you soon